A beautiful city with beautiful women. Look at these ladies here tonight. Mira, preciosas. You know what I like to see? I like to look around the room. I like to see the men with their arms around their ladies. Right? Because if you're a man and there's a woman in your life, this is you part of the day. Right? Everywhere we go, that's my girl right there. Go on, check her out. That's long enough, fucker. I shouldn't talk about it. It's not my lifestyle. But you know what frightens me? Y'all the thought of going to jail. All right? There's my lifestyle. Yours too. You go to jail, guess what? Up the fanny, buddy. Yeah. They're not even gay, they're just bored. <laughs> not me, buddy. I have a plan, I've thought it over. If I ever end up in jail, I'm gonna shit my pants every day I'm in there. You, I'll shit my pants and rub it all over my ass. Oh, go away! Uh, all right, I'll be the dirtiest, nastiest, stinkiest motherfucker in cell block D. It'll be a chore to fuck me, I'll tell you that right now. I mean, guys looking at me, hey, you gotta wash him first. I will stink, but my father will be proud. He's like, hey, well, it fell, but he's a good boy. And the arm's still there. Look around the room, everywhere you go. Had a big theater like this for a long drive in the car, even while we sleep at night. I love you, baby. My arm is fucking numb, but I love you. Not them webs, cause it'll break off. All right? What we don't realize is half of you ladies are down there going real fucking comfortable. Crick in my neck, as long as it makes you feel like the macho shit you think you are. <laughs> Men are retarded, aren't we ladies? Yeah, but you're still fucking us, so what does that say about you? Men are retarded, ladies. Men have two things on their mind. I mean, it's, it's, we're thinking, there's only two things. We're get, thinking about getting laid and getting laid later. That's it. You know, but there's a big difference between men and women. We do things, we live by a different set of rules. We live by the same laws, but we live by a different set of rules, don't we? Sure we do. Girl, girls get away with a little more, I believe. I've never gotten out of a ticket in my life. I get pulled over, what happens? I get a ticket or I go to jail. Depends on how many warrants I have out for my arrest. My sister gets pulled over, she's a beautiful girl. Was that speeding? <laughs> we can't do that, can we, man? What's a, what are we gonna do? Uh, you married officer? Porque yo estaba pensando que maybe, you know... Míralos. Están tibios. All right, the cops looking at me. Hey, you might want to save that for prison, son. Women do things men can't do. Women fix each other's hair. Hey, me pones una trenza? Would you braid my hair? You ever fix your buddy's hair? Oh, uh, what the fuck would you do if we asked you? Hey, dude, can you do something with my hair, bro? Pendejo, si estás pelón. Women share clothes. Oh, my God, that is so pretty. Can I wear it? You ever wear your buddy's clothes? No. Why? Because it's dirty. All right, last time I checked, your stench plus mine equals no pussy. <laughs> Women pee together. You wanna go pee? <laughs> you don't even have to know the guy. I don't know you, but you wanna pee with me? He said, I'm without holding hands, singing songs. Why are you peeing together? Because it's scary in there. Why are you peeing again? Because the line is really long. Well, no shit, Chiquita, you're taking all your friends. <laughs> Men don't pee. A lady got mad at me last night. She goes, what if I run out of paper? I was like, what's your friend gonna do? Blow you dry? I don't understand. <laughs> Could you see that? <laughs> if you need that done, take your man. He'll do that for you. Hey, you're still wet. We're gonna be here all night.
You've been married a long time. How long have you been married? Mamacita, como que no. 37 years, yeah, I know, fuck yeah. You suck your man's dick, don't you? It's okay. Don't be ashamed. You're not a puta sucia, you're a good woman. You're communicating with him. You see people in marriage counseling all the time, he never talks to me. Really? Suck his dick, he'll talk to you. He might be poo, 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 but he's talking. Sucky cocky, it's okay. And men, men, return the favor. Fa la 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 la. That's what it's all about. Don't be ashamed of it. Sucky cocky. Right? Your mama did it. Yes, yeah, she did. Suck your daddy's dick. Probably a couple others. Stop me when I lie. Your beautiful querida abuelita did it. Yeah. In the day of the Depression, when there was nothing to be happy about, nothing to eat. She didn't go hungry. Uh, uh, uh. <laughs> Your great-great-grandma did it in a wagon train. <laughs> <laughs> wagon hole, bitch. <laughs> Stop me when I lie. You know what this is about? People say Mexicans are lazy. Right? That's bullshit, isn't it? That is bullshit. My father, my father came to this, to this country with five children, four dollars, and three jobs. That ain't lazy, that's fucked. But he made it work, you know why? Because he's a hard goddamn worker. He works hard. He moved us into white neighborhoods. We never knew the fucking difference. He worked his ass off all the time. But you know what? He worked hard, but he just never had the right tools. Like, he never used them. Like, if you had something to be fixed in the backyard, you go, hey, Dad, we better go to Home Depot. Home Depot, fuck that. Cabrón, traigo pinzas. Duct tape and brick. The brick will hold it up. The duct tape holds it in. It's like, you ought to try that on mom's ass. <laughs> my dad, we're not lazy. That's bullshit. We're not lazy. Me and my brother have a restaurant called La Chocita, a little Mexican restaurant. And on the window, on the storefront, just like this, we had a guy come in, an artist paint a little mural, right? A montaña with a valley like that, a little nopalito. And I said, put me a little Mexican right there next to a nopalito, sleeping, taking a siesta. My dad came in, he saw it, he goes, oh, go. Que chingos eso? That's La Chocita, Dad, in a little valley in Mexicano taking a siesta. Siesta, goddamn, I never took no fucking siesta. I know all my life, three goddamn jobs, I never think that's why pendejos think we're lazy because of bullshit like that. Quítame ese hijo de la chingada de allí. We had to scrape it off, scrape We repainted it, we put him back on there. We fucking put him pulling a plow, walking a dog, beeper going off. Polillos come in, what the fuck is that? That's a busy fucking Mexican, that's what that is. Thank you very much, God bless you, good night.